All right, everybody. Hello. Oh God, my voice is uh not doing the best today, so I do apologize about that. Give me, actually, just give me uh, one second to get out a quick cough. All right, that should be much better. Hello, everybody. My name is Axel, and welcome to the stream. Today, we're gonna be playing some more Fallout 3. Now, if we go another 10 hours today, I don't fucking know. Uh, depends on what I'm feeling. But yeah. So, we're gonna get everything quickly loaded up. And, yeah. Good. Alright, let's get into it. Let's just, let's just get right into it, you know why? Why, why wait when go? That's all, you, that's all you gotta say. Also, I forgot to change my Twitch name or Twitter name to show that I am indeed live. Because I am simply what you call a Neanderthal, a Nimrod, a not a lot of cuckoo. Not sure what that means, but that sounds insulting. So, you know, you could probably use it. Uh, no, no, I do not wish to make a new game. <clears throat> oh, yeah, we're in fucking dreamland. What am I going to do again? Uh, not, that I, not a good day. This is my home now. Hey, heart shape. Uh, running any mods? Nope. This is a first playthrough for me, and I have no fucking idea what I'm doing, but I know there's a terminal in here. I can't be the gnome. Gnome would be pretty fucking dope. Uh, yeah, no, this is a first run through. I've got. Well, I say first run through. I know bits and bobs of the story. Uh, but yeah, no. Make it crash less. To be honest, I've only ever had a crashing issue when I actually tab out, but I'll definitely look into it. No, I don't want to sleep. Where's the terminal? Do I have to do more quests to get more items? Is that it? Do I have to do more? Um, this house is going to fill up more and more with each and every little quest I do for fucking Betty. The old man. The man. The lad. Uh... No, okay, I have to go into here. Okay, we have to find a way to kill Mrs. Good day. Hi, Mabel. Good day to you. Have you seen my dad? No, I haven't. But when I do, I'll tell him you're looking for him. Okay. This is what? Some kind of computer simulation? I feel like we probably shouldn't go have around spewing day. that. I don't think they're going to believe me anyways. I wish I could reprogram you. That would be an interesting death. Drop a microwave in the... Uh, that gonna be it? Now I'm guessing I have to do something to make the robot angry. <gasps> oh! Oh! Oh my! Well, hi there. Hi. Hmm. 
Mm. Come on, start cleaning. The heavy iron chain layer is supported by an old metal chain. It looks like the chain could be broken, but that could be really dangerous. Ah. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, wait. Good eh? Uh. Okay. the robot clean everything up what I do no you have insulted my honor and for that you must die. what did I do uh oh Okay. Oh, didn't you hear me coming? This is fantastic. Wait, what? Okay. I'm just gonna We're just gonna start over and we're not gonna fiddle with the computer. How about that? That sounds like a good idea. Okay, so at least we now know what to do. But now the robot's gonna be mad. Hello. So is the robot mad that it knows that? I'm guessing the robot's mad because it knows that we killed her. I, I didn't do anything. Gotcha. Can I gonna go over to uh Good day to you. Well sure. Let me just go. Uh oh. Always good for a laugh. Appliances certainly can be dangerous, can't they? Yep. You are most resourceful, and you certainly do get results. You have exceeded my expectations. You have exceeded my expectations. Now, we come to the last tasks that I have for you. Succeed, and you shall be granted whatever you wish. Uh, okay, you're forcing me to do things that are against my nature, and I hate you for it. I don't recall asking for your opinions <laughs> on the matter. If it has not been made perfectly clear to you, I am in control here. I do like him. I dictate your actions and the actions of those around you. You will continue to do exactly as I say, or you will find yourself suffering from a sudden and inexplicable aneurysm. <laughs> yes. 
And that's if I'm feeling generous. For now, though, you will become the pint-sized slasher. You will kill everyone in Tranquility Lane. And you will do this because I say so. Behind the abandoned house, in the doghouse, are a knife and a mask. You will use them to terrorize the residents of this quaint little street. He is a figure of myth, born of old campfire stories. You will make him a reality. The residents will know you, and they will fear you. And they will fear you. Return to me. I am afraid you're not in a position to decide what they do or do not deserve. They are under my control, not yours. Now, if you're done attempting to change my mind, let's get on with your final task. After completing it, you will be free to go. Alright. Also, hey, how are you doing? You got a... Well, now he's given us access to go into the, um... Go into the abandoned house, and so now I wonder... The fuck else is there? I feel like I'm missing a piece of the puzzle. It's pressing. Yeah, that pressing that like alone will go. What the fuck? Okay. A sound puzzle. I fucking hate sound puzzles so much. All right, we're gonna say a big fuck you to this kid. We're gonna give a big fuck you to this kid, to this man, and we're gonna we're gonna do his little puzzle. We're not gonna disturb anyone of that life. Kid had a weird ass voice, but the kid had a regular voice. <laughs> the kid had a regular voice, but he also had like. The deep man voice. No, I'm not talking to her. All right. Science to 40. Sneak to four to 50. 
And, oh wait, no, we did barter. Didn't you? I'm gonna go on tenth training. I'm gonna bump my exception up to eight. Yeah, we're gonna wait to level up here. Regular voice? No, 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 no. The kid, the kid had a little girl voice as well. Fuck it, we're going full charisma. Okay. That's... Yeah, you little bitch. Oh my god! Hi. Let's see. Hey! What did you, what did you do? Now, give me back my goddamn shotgun. Son, you've saved me. I was afraid I'd be trapped in there forever. Oh my god, we actually found so it. good to see you, but, but what are oh you Oh my god, doing our dad. Here? Oh my god, our dad. What the fuck are you doing here? Where's the smokes? Where's the milk? I want answers. Nah. I came to find you, dad. Well, I'm glad you did. This certainly wasn't how I expected things to turn out. I wasn't ready for Braun, or I might have fared better. I think I showed up to save you. What, you didn't like being the dog? Well, I suppose it had its moments. But in the end, I much prefer having opposable thumbs. He was, now that I'm back, he was the dog. Work. I need to tell Madison what I've learned. He... What did you learn? I was right about Braun. Technology he developed is unstable and even dangerous, but it can be adapted for Project Purity. I need to return to Rivet City and talk with Madison. If we can find a Gek, we can make Project Purity work. So you're going back to Rivet City right now? Yes. With what I've learned, Madison is sure to see that we can finally succeed where we failed so many years ago. I'd like you to come with me. <gasps> I'd like you to be there when we finally open the floodgate. Let's fucking head to Rivet City!
Let's hurry. Now that I know what we need, I want to get back to work as soon as possible. Wait, can we just talk for a minute? Of course, son. What's on your mind? How could you just leave me like that? What what the hell were you thinking? I wanted you to be safe. I didn't want this for you. A life out here in this godforsaken war zone. I couldn't tell you what I was doing because I didn't want you following me. A plan which clearly was not as successful as I imagined it would be. Why would you put yourself at risk like this? You have some sort of... It's not mom. Are you trying so hard because of what happened to her? Oh, my son. If only you could have known how much it meant to her. She believed in the work we were doing and was so determined to see it through. She gave up so much for this project. We all did. And I don't want that to have been for nothing. <sighs> I don't understand, but okay. Tell my son. While this isn't what I have in mind, it's good to have you with me. Okay. How did mom really die? I understand that you have reason to question a good many things I've told you over the years. But your mother... I've never lied to you about what happened. Not once. She died giving birth to you. It was a difficult time. She was so eager to meet you, to make a place for you in the world. If nothing else, please believe that she loved you very much. What's the big deal about water, anyways? I have to go. Be careful, my son. Oh. oh I didn't even notice my dad was actually here. All right, Dad. Let's uh, let's get the fuck out of here. Let's skedaddle and skedoodle. Oh my God, you are much faster than me. What? How? You're old. You're feeble. You're like a man who just. Hello, sir. Hello, sir. My voice is gonna crack a lot, so uh, just uh, just a heads up. Well, I would say that, but I mean, I'm 21 canonically. I think. Yeah, I think I'm 21 canonically. So it's like. Well, I can believe that he is a Dilf. He's also quite a bit older than that. Don't worry, Dad. I'll I'll beat you to fucking Rivet City. Eh. Let it end like this. Who we find, Dad? There we go. Okay, now we can fast travel. Hey, fuck him! Put up the bridge. Welcome to Rivet City. I don't know why you didn't have the bridge out. I'm. Literally every other time I've come through, you have to break. You've had to bridge out. <laughs> Why is now so different? Chris? Oh, didn't elapse time. My dad's just stuck there forever. Will probably be until I get here. Science lab. There he is. Yeah, he just fast traveled in. Addison Lee. Got him. I've got a present. You're the man you've been having an affair with. Hey, and I'm back. I told you it would work, Madison. And now I can prove it. Jamie, you're back. 
Yeah. And with good news. I was right about Braun and the Geck. If we can find one, we can adapt it to work with the Purifier. I'd like to believe you, James. I really would. This is all just so... so sudden. Madison, I'm telling you, this is real. I talked to Braun himself. He confirmed it. Don't you see? This is what we've been waiting for. I... I don't know, James. So many years have passed. Is it really still worth trying? Yes! How could it not be worth improving the lives of everyone in the world? Oh, so like that voice crack. What yes! <laughs> As important to me as ever, Madison. I know it's important to you too. Let's finish it together. James, I... we don't have a geck. I can get a small team together, but we'll need proof that it works before people believe us. I can go. No, I was thinking about that. The lab at the facility had some old pre war computers that we scavenged. One of them might be useful. From the last reports, there's no power at the facility. Even if one of those computers had a database, we couldn't access it. That's why we're going to head over there right now and get things up and running as best we can. Yeah, you just tell me what I need to do. If there were anyone else asking me to do this, I'd have them run right out of Rivet City. And you know I wouldn't be here if I didn't think this would really work. It's time, Madison. I, I feel Danny, like I'm... James, when this is all over, you owe me a drink. I'll get the team together. I feel like I'm about to get a new yes. mom. It's good to be working with you again. Is everything all right? Uh, Did you need something? N no. I'm just thinking that y'all are probably going to get together. Did you need something? Ayo, Ayo, new, new mom DLC one. Hey. Oh, you're not who I thought you were. Yes. Yes. Fucking flip your hair while you're at it. Go, yes. This applies to everyone. Chubby dooby. Also, video. Wondering why everything seems so quiet. But um, bum ba da dum. Wait, where am I going? Eh. Eh. That we're going to the old lab. Oh, the Rivet City. Decided to check out the shop. Need, need something for killing, eh?
Give me a shout if you need anything. If you Raiders Stay can't be bargained Scott. or reasoned. Have a seat anywhere. Someone will be. There ain't no use surrendering. Cause they'll just shoot you anyway. So run, hide, or fight if you got the balls and the guns. But for Hello? God's sake, don't go waving the white flag. They'll just strangle you with it. Now, some music. <laughs> We need to get back to Project Purity. The computer there is our best chance to locate a Gek. Won't that, won't that be dangerous? Probably, but we have to try, don't we? It's too important for the people of the Wasteland to let fear stop us now. We need to get moving right away. Are you coming with us? All right, let's get going. That's my boy. It'll be good to work side by side with you, son. Join the scientist. Okay, well, fucking I. Okay, and over here. God damn it, damn it. Fucking A. Hey there. I'm not trying to put you off, but we need to get to Project Purity. Anything else can wait until later. Well, we need to start fucking running instead of just slow starting our stuff. Alright, I'm getting my fucking assault rifle out. Not trying to put you off. What? <laughs> Walks at you. I'm not trying to put you off. What? What? Hello. Son. Hello. Did you need something? Give me dad. Eight one four three zero oh, nine six seven. Is everything all right? Yeah, um, I'm waiting for you to do what you need to do. Need something? Good to see you. Hello, son. Hi. Here we are, where it all began. You remember your mother's favorite passage, Revelation twenty-one ah. six. I am Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end. I will give unto him that is a thirst of the fountain of the water of life freely. Don't you see? This is what it all means. The water, the purifier. This is the water of life. Your mother's dream. No point in wasting time. Let's get to work. There's much to be done. All right. What exactly does needs to be done right now? The project was abandoned shortly after you were born. Things have deteriorated here since then. And there's been some flooding. 
I need you to get to the flood control pumps and activate them so we can clear out the water and reach the mainframe. Okay. Uh, where do I need to go? The automatic doors sealed when the flooding occurred. So you'll have to use the access tunnels to reach the pumps. Gotcha. And no one's gonna come with me because I'm a strong independent boy and I can handle myself. I've got my safety helmet. What a doomer. Hello, friend. Hi. Hi. Hello, friends. Oh yeah, I've already been down here. I killed all the mutants because this is where I thought we were meant to go. <laughs> you see, they're all dead. Bum, 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 bum. God Bethesda, you fucking whore. Okay. Everything all right? Uh Hang on. Keep up to Oh, I ain't no hand to work on the pumps. Hurry yes, back. I'm six feet tall and I ain't no okay. Bum ba dum bum bum. I don't know why you couldn't have just given me the fuses before, but you know. I guess they need me. I guess they need a reason for me to leave so the water can drain. I've been hearing good things about you. Is it true? Did you really disarm the bomb and Megaton? Yeah, I disarmed the bomb. I'm very proud of you, even though you put yourself in harm's way. Just please be careful out there. This is a dangerous world. Far more dangerous than anyone in that vault knows. Right. The flooding shorted out some of the fuse boxes downstairs, including one that controls some of the automatic doors. Here, take these fuses. The box is back down in the sub-basement near the eastern end of the level. Once the fuses are replaced, you'll be able to get to the mainframe. Gotcha. What exactly is Project Purity? It started as an idea, really. Remember the Bible passage? Of yes, I remember it. Free, clean water for everyone. What a difference it could make in the lives of everyone here in the wastes. Over time, that idea took the form of a purifier. Not like the one in the vault, though. This one was gigantic, capable of purifying millions of gallons of water at once. We used the old Jefferson Memorial for the location, right on DC's tidal basin. Someday soon, I hope you'll see it work. Keep that in mind the next time you feel like nosing around that neighborhood. Thanks for listening, children. This is free. All right. When you're listening to Galaxy News Radio, we're hey. Radio Free hey Wasteland, and we're here for you. Now, some music. Guaranteed I'm going to come in the Meyer Lurks down here.
Okay. Fuck me, got it. Also, the fact that this place is able to purify millions of water, like million gal or what do you say, a million gallons of water a fucking day? That is impressive. Or did he say millions? I'm not sure. Not sure at all. There are a few minor repairs still to be made up here in the control room. Why don't you come back here and give me a hand? Actually, wait. There's one other thing I need you to do. Jana says there's a blockage in one of the intake pipes. It's on your way back. Head back up to the museum level. And give me a call on the intercom when you get there. Okay. I'll see you when I enjoy this kind of <clears throat> this kind of stuff. And I I enjoy this kind of stuff. It uh it seems fun. Oh my god, I thought you were a super mutant, dude. You were about to get shot. You were about to get shot up like a... F you about to get lit up like a fucking Christmas tree, man. I'm not gonna lie to you. Here's Dina Khan. Bum-ba-dum-bum-bum-ba-dum-bum. Barrel ghouls? Question mark. Uh, maybe mire lurks. Rad roaches. Swear to God, I'll kill every one of these bastards if they try to touch my dad. Why the fuck do they have power armor? Hey! Oh fuck, you are gonna attack me. I didn't actually think they'd attack me. Oh, you bastards. Why are you shooting at a kid? It's kind of fucked at you. I'm not going to lie. Oh, you don't have power armor. You have enclave armor. Give me your armor. At least your weapon. And you, okay, you do have power. Fucking potato, but fucking potato tomato.
I didn't mean to do Psycho. Oh. Looks like I'm taking drugs. Gotta help me dad out somehow. These motherfuckers are trying to take my dad away. I just got him fucking back. Hey, you big bastards. Civilian. You goddamn bastard. Of the president, you know what I've decided, this children? facility is now I'm under United States club. government control. Right the person now. in charge is to join? step forward Good. immediately no and choice. turn over all materials related to this project. It's quite impossible. Survival this guy. is a private project. Ron Clay has no authority. Moira Brown. I'm going to have to ask you to oh, leave. And get this. Am I to assume, sir, that you are in charge? <laughs> yep, you guessed it. That tenacious teenager from Vault 101. Now, let me tell you. Thing. Yes, I'm responsible for this project. Then I repeat, sir, that you are hereby instructed to immediately hand over all materials related to the purifier. I'm sorry, but that's... Furthermore, you are to assist Enclay scientists in assuming control of the administration and operation of this facility at once. Colonel, is it Colonel? I'm sorry, but the facility is not operational. It never has been. I'm afraid you're wasting your time here. Sir, this is the last time I am going to repeat myself. Stand down at once and turn over control of this facility. Colonel, I assure you that this facility will not function. We have never been able to successfully replicate test results. I suggest you comply immediately, sir, in order to prevent any more incidents. Are we clear? Yes, Colonel. We'll do whatever you want. There's no need for more violence. Then you will immediately hand over all materials related to this project and aid us in making it operational at once. Very well. Give me a few moments to bring the system online. Oh my god. My patience wears thin. Nearly finished. Dad, run! What? What the fuck? What is he doing in there? I, I, what? Jane, he's gone. We have to get out of here. They'll be coming for us next. We've got to evacuate now. The hell just happened? James, your father caused an overload. He sacrificed himself to keep the that, that voice cracked and we're just gonna we're gonna we're gonna ignore it apparently i can't i can only go deep i can't go like my voice cannot go high anymore or else your father died in vain i'm not fucking leaving my father in there there's nothing anyone can do for him now the radiation levels in there are lethal you die the same way he did we need to get out of here now Fuck, lead the way. Old tunnel that will lead us out of here to someplace safe. We used it as an evacuation route once before, but that was a long time ago. I hope everyone remembers how to get there. There isn't time to round everyone up. Come on, follow me and hurry. God fucking damn it. Oh my god, also the fucking Chinese assault rifle. Jesus Christ.
I, uh, you can't tell I really want the power armor. <laughs> Oh my god. Yeah, I know. That's why I'm We're going to need you. This tunnel leads to the Citadel, the Brotherhood of Steel's fortress. We should be safe there if we can make it. I don't know what's ahead. That's the problem. No one has used these tunnels in years, but we can't stay put. The Enclave will find us eventually. We have to get moving. We need to keep everyone together, and we need to get through this tunnel as quickly as possible. We're not safe until we reach the other side. You should stay close, and we'll follow behind you. We'll be right behind you. Be careful. Yeah, get the fuck behind me. Braids. Brads. Fuck you, Enclave. It's ghouls. And now, one of my inspirational quotes. Keep your mouth and your business. Trouble. Lock door up ahead. I can open it, but it'll take some time. Yeah, everyone get by. Fuck off. All right. Well, Fuck you. Okay, aid. Your shit rock from the fucking chrome dome, bitch. Oh, fuck this, too. All right. 
Damn. Oh, fuck. Oh. Fucking disintegrate your ass. to escape while we can I know what did you do fucking stick behind me Combat shotgun time. We can't go any further. We need to stop. Why? Garza has a heart condition. He needs medicine or he may not make it. I'm not moving until he gets the medicine he needs. What can I do? I don't have sufficient medical supplies with me or else this wouldn't be a problem. If you have any stim packs, I would ask that you hand them over. Maybe you're right. Very well, I'll tell him and then we'll continue. Let's make this quick. Garza, I'm sorry, but we must keep moving. If we can't keep up, I'm afraid he'll have to go on without you. But what will I do? You would leave me here alone? Garza, I'm sorry, we have to go now. I do not feel good for doing that. I'm gonna try to reload and redo all this without uh using up all my fucking stim packs. Fucking weapons, can I? No. I'm just gonna do an auto save instead of reloading all the way fucking back here. Which means there must be a stim pack around here somewhere. We can't go any further. We need Garza has 
I don't have... We cannot continue to delay here. Something must... Fucking A. I am so dangerously low right now. Are there seriously not any fucking... Okay, it's not a lot, but I could probably get back down there now. Fuck!
God, fuck, I'm so close to death. Fucking A. I can't leave Garza here in the We cannot Yes. I am sorry. I do not have my usual. Yes, you were right. Garza. <sighs> but I have a stim pack right here. I'm sorry. I don't know what to do. the combat shotgun back out. Hey there. I hear we have you. I don't really want to die down here. Oh, I like that voice line. I don't really want to die down here. All right, I'm going to save here. Dr. Lee, are you fucking serious? Ah. Oh my god, you fucking stand right in the fucking way. What is it? We'll be This ain't a tourist trap. You civilians get topside immediately. We were so close and we just left him behind. Yeah. I don't know why that other guy had to stay behind. We were literally so close. And I've I am think I am addicted to uh... What is it? You're kind of an asshole. Yeah, you can get addictions. I have people with me in need of shelter. You must allow us access at once. I'm sorry. No unauthorized civilians allowed inside the city. 
You'll have to leave now. Liar! I know you're in there! I know you can hear me! You open this goddamn door right now! Oh! Oh my god! Well, god damn! Yeah, anger works. I am so close to. to I'm not stopping. I was following you, but you know what? Never mind. Fuck you. I'm going ahead. You can suck my fat cock. Okay. So. So, what does science do again? Represents. Yeah. Um. And we'll go to 70 for each. And shall go. Hi, Linus. Matters, and I'm surprised to see you here. What can I do for you? Don't talk down to me, Lions. I had nowhere else to turn. You must help us. Project Purity has been overrun. <laughs> yes, I'd heard reports of an incident there. What details can you give us? The Enclave. They've attacked Project Purity. James is dead. There may be more. I don't know. You have to do something. Then it's as we feared. Madison, I'm sorry this happened. I wish we could have done something. Then do something now. They've taken over the purifier. Lions, they cannot be permitted to have control over it. It's not right. No, no, no. Calm down. You know as well as I do that the purifier doesn't work. It's useless to them. Perhaps it's time to walk away. That's not true. James, he found what's been missing. We know how to get it running. Is that so? Does the Unclave know this? When did you pick no, up a pipe? I don't think... I, I don't know. I, I just don't know what's happening anymore. All right, Madison. It'll be okay. Now, this is James's son, I presume? I can see... Yeah, I want to join... I want to join the pal... Yes. I want to... Yeah, I want to join. He knows what we need. Vault Tech computer, something to locate equipment. Please help him. Very well, we'll sort this all yeah, out. Yeah, uh, first, can I get a bed to sleep in? I'm, like, so close to death. I... I need to rest, lie down, or something. This is just too I... Much. Yes, I do too. Rothschild should help you, but don't forget that he's Brotherhood. I've never trusted them. Be careful what you tell them. And Lions, sir. At ease, son. Hail. Hail. You just managed to get yourself into all sorts of trouble, don't you? Welcome to the Citadel. Not many civilians get to see the place. Oh, I found the Brotherhood holotype. What should I do with them? Talk to Scribe Jameson. She is our keeper of the scrolls. She will want to know what you have found. All right. Glad to be of help. Uh. Ew. Weird question just came from him. Didn't know they existed. Uh, any thoughts on the Enclave? I've read the report, seen the initial scans, but I can hardly believe it. I figured those radio transmissions were just old recordings. Never figured the Enclave would actually show up in the flesh. But don't worry. Whatever they try, we'll be ready for it. I'll lead the Pride to knock them out tomorrow. If my father permits it. Uh. I have to go now. In my father's name, I bid you farewell. 
I need a bed like ASAP. I'm pretty sure I have like three bones ejected from my leg. I need health. I need help. I need hospitality. Some, some southern hospitality would be very nice. May I start by saying that I am sorry for your loss. I was acquainted with your father many years ago. The world has lost one of its few remaining visionaries. Thank you for the sympathy. Think nothing of it. Okay, then now, fuck you. Dr. Lee has explained your predicament. You need to locate some vault tech equipment. <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> Are you quite sure? I suspect that would be a waste of time. Regardless, the Brotherhood is not in possession of such a device. There is, however, a way in which we may be able to ascertain the location of one. Possibly. I'm afraid I won't be able to assist you directly. The news Dr. Lee has brought will require me to be elsewhere. I can, however, give you access to an old pre-war computer from vault tech it may have the information you need you'll find the terminal in the archives in the a ring indeed farewell Um, I don't think that Paladin Gunny would be very happy if he saw me talking to an outsider. You honor us with your presence here. Hello, Capital Wasteland. This is Three Dog. Ow! Coming to you loud and proud from Galaxy News Radio. Got lots of stuff going down in post apocalyptia these days. Here's some of the latest news. It's that time again, kids. The adventures of the Capital Crusader. I've decided, children, I'm gonna start a book club right now. Wanna join? Good, cause you got no choice. Our first masterpiece is called The Wasteland Survival Guide, written by Megaton's own Moira Brown. Oh, and get this, researched and co-authored by none other than, <laughs> yep, you guessed it, that tenacious teenager from Vault 101. Now, let me tell you, this thing's got all sorts of useful tips. Where to find food, how to deal with radiation, tons of stuff. Survive, thrive, and revive. That's the name of the game. The book is the Wasteland Survival Guide. Pick up your copy today. Until next time, this is Three Dog. Ow! And you're listening to Galaxy News Radio, bringing you the truth, no matter how bad it hurts. And now, a super important public service announcement. We all know the dangers of radiation, but with the right precautions, you can prevent accidental death or even, ew, ghoulification. Keep your eyes on those Geiger counters, kids. Tick, tick, tickety means run your ass out of there, and then pop some rat away for good measure.
Damn, how long has my mic been muted? I just did my whole outro. <laughs> I just did my whole fucking outro. Okay, anyways. Um, so, yeah, no, I, I, was, uh, I was doing my outro. Anyways, so, from the top. Today was a relatively shorter stream, but I should be streaming later tonight with Moach, so I'm kind of saving. I'm kind of saving all my energy for that. I'm also hungry. I'm kind of starting to get a headache because I haven't had anything to eat. Either way, I hope you have a wonderful day, afternoon, night, whatever time it is for you. I hope you have a wonderful time. And thank you all for coming. Thank you all for watching the vod. And I will see you. Well, hopefully later tonight. All right. Goodbye, everybody. I will see you next stream. I love you all. And goodbye.